everyone. In this video, I will show you how to make this cardigan with uh, granny squares. I want to show you the back side too. And it's for medium size. If you want to make it a little bigger, large or X large size, um, I want to show you here. You can see there is three line uh, at the back. You can add one more line here with uh, more motifs. And uh, if you want, you can make this uh, ribbing uh, a little longer. Um, and when I said longer, this uh, arms a little long for me, but I could uh, use them like that. If you don't want to use them like that, you can uh, make two uh, squares less at the sleeves and make here maybe a single crochets or you can use it like that. I think I can use it like that too. And uh, when I made this one, uh, I used uh, so many colors as you see. I'll write the uh, uh, yarn's name and the colors and how many yarns I use. All of them at the description box. Uh, you can find uh, all this uh, information there. And I use 6 mm and uh, 5 mm crochet hooks. 6 mm for the uh, squares and 5 mm for the ribbing. <laughs> and he wants to say hi too, but he's too heavy. I cannot carry him. Okay, say hi. <laughs> and I hope you like this. If you are ready, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and let's start. I made a video about this square before. Uh, you can show it here and at the end of the video. And I will just make one loop of double crochet like I did here. Um, I will start from here. Just take the yarn, make three chains. Insert into same place. Make two double crochet. With this three chain, it's three double crochet here. And insert into the first stitch. Make a double crochet into the next one make a double crochet by the way I'm hiding these two tails because it will be easier like that and just keep making double crochets for all the stitches I have I'm at the corner again. I will make three double crochets here. Two, three. Chain three. Insert into the same place and make one, two, three double crochet. And starting from the first stitch, Keep making double crochets. For this one side, you will have totally 18 uh, double crochets. Uh, just finish uh, this row 
uh, life that I'll see you when you came here. I'm at the end. I will insert here, make three double crochet. Then for this time, chain two. And uh, all the other corners, I made three chains. For here, we will make something like that. Cut this uh, yarn, and if I could find my needle, I will insert my needle from here. Then insert it into that chain. We create a um, stitch here, a chain here, and finish this row like that. I like to make it like that because I don't want um, I don't want it to look bad because I don't want to uh, see a bad looking edge here you can join uh, as you know uh, it will work either way uh, and now we will join uh, our squares together okay I want to show you this I have totally 32 squares and uh, I separate two parts it's six square and six square totally uh, 12 that's four arms and here I have uh, 20 uh, squares you can think this 12 here for back and this panel and this panel for front okay uh, I put them like that because um, I want to show all of them together that's the biggest <laughs> that's the biggest view we can reach now so now I will join them first like that okay I will join here and here and here keep making like that for all of these squares then I will join them um, vertically is it vertical yes I think so I will join them like that now I'll show you how to join together uh, I want to tell you one more thing I will tell you again but um, if I forget or something like that if you want to uh, keep going uh, before me don't forget we will not join here we will not join here and here these are our armholes here okay now we can join I put them like that and I will take two from this last one and I will put them like that uh, wrong sides uh, are outside looking to us and uh, right side is in uh, are inside 
I will join from here. Take the yarn, make a chain, insert into same place and make a single crochet. I will put them like that. Now I will insert into that first stitch, both of this stitch, both loops of this stitch and insert into the first stitch again. Grab the yarn, pull it and pull it through one more time. Make a slip stitch again. Insert into the next stitch and next stitch here. Wrap the yarn, make a slip stitch. Make a slip stitch. I will keep making like that. Don't make the slip stitch too tight. And that's the last one. When I complete here, I will insert into the chain space and make a single crochet. Then chain one. Okay, we will finish this first two. It will look like that. By the way, I made a video about joining methods and there's uh, some other methods uh, I shared with you. If you want to use one of them, you can use. You can find them here, here now. And at the end of the video, of course. Now, I will take two from this second set if I could show you I take them from here and I will keep it going like that okay again uh, right side looking to each other inside I will insert here, make a single crochet and starting from first stitch, make slip stitch. Take both loops, and keep joining. I will join uh, this uh, uh, five squares, uh, five, five, ten actually, squares. Then uh, I'll see you again. I finished the first set and make my last single crochet, then chain one, cut the yarn. Now I will keep going from here. This time I will put them like that. Okay. I will put them and join from here. And when I complete it, okay, when I join here, I will open it like that again 
and take the last one and join it. Join it. I'll just keep making like that and finish all of this. Then I'll uh, show you how I made it. Uh, I will make and turn. I join all of them. I can show you like that. And now I will join vertically. I will make them like that. And start from here. Make a single crochet into same place and take both loops. Okay, it will be a little hard because um, that's the chain three. It's hard to insert it. I will only use one for this one and keep making. I will join here And that's the last one. I will make a single crochet into that space, then chain one. Insert here directly, make a single crochet. Then keep joining with the same way. I've joined here. Don't forget, you will not join this last two here. That will be the arm space. Then, uh, when you finish this one, finish joining here, you will put it like that. Wait a minute, I will show you. When you finish joining here, you will put it like that this time. Like that and join here. When you complete this one, you will put it... Oops, it's so hard. Put it like that and join here and when it comes to that last one, don't forget you will not join here. I will keep making and see you. Now it's almost a vest. One last thing we will join here, here. 
like that. Put a single crochet Insert into the first stitch and first stitch again I miss a stitch here. You can see it. I think, yeah. I'll keep making like that and join here at the end. I'll make a single crochet here. Uh, chain one and cut the yarn and make the other side with the same way I join here and made one of the arms and join it I will make the other one and show you now and don't uh, look at it now it looks like that but uh, it looks bad like that actually but we will iron it it will be a little bigger than that and more flat than that of course now we will make the arms uh, just put them like that i think that's good for the sleeves first we will join, start to join from here and join all of them. Then turn it and join here. Then join here and here. You know how to make here. I'll make this two and I will show you how to make here. You know these two, but it's a little um complicated than here so i will show you just join this two and see you i join this two side now we'll join here starting from here insert my hook into the three chain space Make a single crochet then hold it like that and start to join with slip stitch. Keep making. Oh, I want to um, tell you something. I saw something yesterday. Uh, I was watching YouTube. Uh, there's a channel uh, name. Its names uh, 140 Junos. Junos. It's some kind of documentary channel, but it's not an ordinary channel. Uh, I like to uh, watch them and uh, they're making um different uh, about uh, they are making documentary videos about different topics how can i explain it i don't know it's like that so i will make a single crochet here chain one and turn and again 
make a single crochet here keep joining and they made a, a video about youtubers before and yesterday i saw another video about youtubers again that's the second video and uh, we are um, we are eating dinner <laughs> at the time of uh, it me and uh, my husband and my daughter and uh, just start to watch this uh, video and uh, I saw myself <laughs> in this documentary uh, uh, just for a few seconds uh, but <laughs> it was so weird uh, I think I'm famous <laughs> just for uh, 10 seconds maybe uh, they made me uh, famous in YouTube <laughs> I made a single crochet here chain one insert here make a slip stitch chain one again cut this yarn yeah it's like that i really really shocked uh, i never expect this uh, it's not an important thing by the way just a few seconds as i said before but that's the channel i uh, follow every time i see myself there and that's too weird <laughs> and now I will join here and here complete it then we will join this part to the uh, uh, body now we can join this ones I'll make the same thing actually that's the back side of uh, my work again inside and inside here uh, I will start from here make a single crochet then keep joining It's and I made a chain and if I could work <laughs> with it I will make a slip stitch here chain one cut the yarn Now it's time for the ribbing. I will start from here. Oh, it's too heavy right now. I use, I think, uh, I think 700 or 800 grams of yarn here. I will start from here. By the way, I am using 5mm crochet hook 
for the ribbing at corner bottom corner one two three four five six seven eight and nine let's turn your chains like that sorry yes you see this back loops here skip this first one insert into the second one and make a single crochet into the next one single crochet single crochet make eight single crochet Let me count. There is one less. It's here. Yes. I will insert into that first stitch here. Make a slip stitch into the next one. Make one more slip stitch and turn. I will make single crochets, but I will only use back loops. Just skip these two slip stitches, you see? And into that first single crochet's back loop, insert your hook and make a single crochet into the next one three four five six seven and eight chain one turn I made it like that I want to show you I don't want to turn it like that I don't want to take this yarn from front to back I don't want that look so I will turn my yarn around my hook because I don't want to turn all of this um, cardigan I made chain one and now I will make back loop only single crochets again. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. insert into here that's the last stitch we made our slip stitch insert into the, this next one make a slip stitch next one make a slip stitch and turn again skip two slip stitches make your single crochets chain one and turn make your back loop only single crochets four five six seven eight And again, make a slip stitch here, make a slip stitch into the next one. I'll just keep making like that 
just go ahead and make the same thing i will catch you in some place i'm not sure now i came here and i want to show you how i turn here uh, it's same you can make it here and here Chain one, make single crochets. And I'm here now, I made my last slip stitch here. I will put a slip stitch here and put one here. Turn, make single crochets. By the way, uh, I show you like that uh, I made this only uh, this back loop but I change my mind and I make it like that I uh, take both loops it's not too important uh, I just want to make it like that if you uh, didn't make it like that don't worry One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And then I will insert into here. insert into here make a slip stitch and again insert into same place make one more slip stitch turn and make your single crochets Turn again. Insert here this joining point, make a slip stitch and make a slip stitch here turn make your single crochets chain one turn and insert into that first stitch and second stitch turn and make your single crochets and finish this side too 
I made the last one drawing here with a slip stitch and make a chain. Now I will cut this yarn. And starting from here, I will make single crochets. Insert my hook here. Grab this yarn. Insert into same place. Make a single crochet. And I will hide this yarn too. Insert here, make one more here, and make single crochets for all the stitches you have. Um, I will just make one row with single crochet. If you want, you can make more rows and uh, just go ahead like that finish this row. I reach here and use both loops make single crochets that's the last one chain one, cut the yarn just take a yarn needle and hide this yarn I will make the same thing for the sleeves starting from anywhere. I will make single crochets around sleeves and uh, I will finish like that. Uh, you can put one single crochet here. If you want you can put one single crochet here. I didn't make here. I just put one single crochet here and one here. Keep making like that. If you want, you can put one here too. And turn around like that. I will make just one row. Uh, if you want, you can make more. Uh, just make them and finish this uh, cardigan. And that's it. Uh, I hope you like this tutorial. If you like, please don't forget to push the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Series Crochet is my Instagram and Pinterest and website address. You can reach me anywhere uh, you want. And uh, you can write comment below uh, at the same time. Uh, that's it for today. Hope to see you again. Have a nice day.